When I grew up as a kid, uh, Jacques Cousteau was on TV. That was a show a lot of us watched, and you know, how fun that must be to go scuba diving and, and go in submarines. I think a lot of people have this romantic notion about being a marine biologist, but being a marine biologist is actually a lot of work. It's not glamorous work. It's not what people expect. Dr. Robert Zeller has been a professor at San Diego State for 20 years and is currently in his fourth year as chair of the Department of Biology. I'm a molecular biologist by training, but I've always been interested in marine organisms. I've raised octopuses in high school. That's what got me interested in the process of development. My interests now sort of combine those two uh, in trying to understand the way in which the building blocks are assembled and the way in which those building blocks are used. Dr. Zeller's primary research has been focused on ascidians, commonly referred to as sea squirts. Sea squirts are very closely related to ourselves. Um, humans need to form as embryos. Sea squirts use those genes as well. Because they're a very simple organism, it's much easier to study processes in these animals than in humans. There are labs that have developed sea squirt models of diseases. My lab actually developed a model of Alzheimer's disease and found that we could actually recreate various aspects of the disease progression in these animals within 24 hours. It's, it's the right biological material to really investigate what we're interested in. One of the things I fondly remember growing up are all of the teachers and professors that took an interest in me and my friends over the years. And as a professor at SDSU, that's one of the things that I've also strived to do is to give undergraduates and graduate students opportunities and whether they go on to professional school, graduate school, I hope that I've been able to instill in them a, a love of science and a love of learning and I hope that that's something that they can keep with them uh, throughout their lives.